Welcome to the Shovel Warehouse, my name is Zed. This week is Fan Submission Week, which means we're looking at games that developers have actually submitted to be played on the channel, for some reason. Today we're looking at Happy Turd, which is a clone of the inexplicably popular Flappy Bird. I, I, don't, I don't know, I don't have a whole lot to say about that, so I'm just going to queue up the video. Here it is. It's time to clap along if you feel like a room without a roof, because we are happy as a happy turd. Uh, I've already tried to play this game, try and figure out what it is you do, and uh, I'm not very good at it. And you'll see why in a minute. Okay, so this is a Flappy Bird clone, except it's with poo, which is obviously an improvement. Um, it was made, I think, during the Flappy Jam. I don't know, I'll have to check with the developer. If it wasn't, then I'm sorry that I just insinuated it was. And, uh, here we go with some happy turd. Okay. Excellent start. Alright, so what you have to do, you don't actually... Oh. Um, you, you don't jump according to, like, when you press the button as you would in Flappy Bird. You jump when you hit the toilet roll. Which, I mean, you know, it's an improvement over over Flappy Bird. It's kind of a depth of gameplay. I'm still utterly shit at it. But I, I think that's maybe the point. Oh, oh no, no. I mean, it's it's well animated, you know, which is uh, surprising for a game of this otherwise questionable quality. Let's just see if we can get through the first goddamn. Yeah, there we go. That's one. Oh my god, my turd is flying now. We are on fire. We are a flaming turd. Come on. Oh god damn it. And uh, as 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 Flappy Bird clones go, I've played worse. As games go, I've played worse, which should tell you pretty much the kinds of games. Oh wow, that went right through the middle of two of them. That was awful. That should let you know the kinds of games that I spend my time playing. This is what running the shovel warehouse does to a person. When you're playing a reasonably well animated Flappy Bird clone that's about poo and deciding that it's not the worst thing you've played this week. Uh, it's a little bit choppy. That's probably my terrible PC. In which case, this game actually suits my PC. It's about the same quality level. I really do need to get a new PC. This game has really made me think about my hardware. I mean... I have to get a new PC so that I can play such sterling, top-quality titles as this. Look, I've given it a slow-motion mode because I can't run it properly. Is it just... Oh, no, there we go. We're back. We're on. No, we're not. Well, I don't think I'm going to break three. I think three is about my limit. Who knows, though? Here we go. We're going to try one more time. Get a rhythm. Don't get a rhythm. I do recommend you try this one, especially if you played Flappy Bird, because this kind of gives you more of a more of a challenge, I would say, than Flappy Bird. Um, that line on the screen is supposed to be there. You can't put toilet rolls down in front of the line. You have to do it behind the line, which is why it's so difficult, because you're constantly kind of judging the angle of the turd. That's a sentence I've said today. Yeah, locking up again. Yeah. It's just it's just too high quality. It's too demanding to run properly. Which is a shame. Um although this being the shovel warehouse, I'd like to think that the choppy performance of the game reasonably fitting. Um I I realize this is shit, literally. But I can't stop playing it. It's 
kind of got that one more go factor. Much like a good shit. So maybe that's what this is. Maybe it's a interactive interpretation of a really satisfying poo. Maybe that's what the developer was trying to get across. You know, because I mean, sometimes, sometimes you'll be on the toilet and you'll really have to strain. And you'll have to work at it. Like a constipated maths teacher who works it out with a pencil. I'm not even apologising for that. Given the quality of the game, the subject matter, I don't think I should have to apologise for bad jokes. Oh, okay. Looks like he's just going to do that again. Alright. Alright, here we go. This is it. All or nothing. Go for broke. Oh god. Oh god. I get caught up watching the last one and then forget to place the next one. That's what happens. Oh, that was so close. But, um, but do go give this a try because despite being about turds, reasonably playable insofar as a Flappy Bird clone is playable. It'll probably run much better on your computer because your computer will not be a toaster. In fact, um, the reason I'm playing this is because you see the, the background as it scrolls along there? All the waste in the sewage. If you look very, very closely somewhere in that mire, you can actually see the computer that I'm running this on. Because that's where I got it from. Yeah. Right down there. Just under this pipe here. Oh, well, no, that's it. Well, that was ha that was Happy Turd. Uh, a game that was, quite literally, shit.